Really, Stoke Monkey? Really? Really? What, what other residuals are you getting? Are are those those other, th other than the Build-A-Bear Workshop? Build-A-Bear build 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 Workshop, I've got my own line of Stoke Monkey banana flavored uh, candy coming out. Uh, it's, 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 all, it's all part of the big push to the White House. Oh, so this is all going towards your, uh, your, um, your political campaigning then? Uh, no, it's going right in my pocket. Oh, that's because kind of selfish. I don't, pay, I don't pay a dime for my, uh, for my, uh, political campaign. That's why I come on the show. What Which about my, charities, sir? Oh, oh, I, I donate to charities. I mean, but it, it's hard. I don't really have a lot of extra cash, but with my 17 to 18 different monkey mouths to feed. Oh. It's very difficult. Very difficult. Well, then how how are you are you are you saying you are more capable than John McCain oh, by yes. being able to multitask seventeen or eighteen children and run the run this country at the same time? Absolutely. I mean, how many McCain how how many little McCainlings does he have? Four, two, three. It doesn't matter. It's not as much as Stuck Monkey. He's a bad father. I'm gonna go ahead and say that. You want to put that out there, right there? You're John McCain, McCain a bad father. John McCain. Bad for his kids, bad for America. Oh. Stoke Monkey approves. Of, of me saying that, not of John McCain. Oh. Okay. Really? Uh, really. Huh. So, so how, how, how... <laughs> how, <laughs> how do you feel about Sarah Palin, then? I'd plow it like a snow day. <laughs> She's the last kids gap, school. <laughs> Got to get those kids to school, right, Stoke Monkey? That's correct. Got to get uh, them kids to school. We have Jeez. a question from the chat room for you, Stoke Monkey. Sure, sure. Can you name more than one court case? C court case? Court case. Sure. Name some. Uh, besides Roe versus Wade. Besides Roe versus <laughs> Wade. Well, there was State versus Stoke Monkey, but I that I don't. That's kind of still in litigation. I don't like to get into that one. Uh, there was uh, the People versus Miranda. Which uh, is why we have, that's why we call them the Miranda rights. Um, there was uh, People versus Dred Scott. Uh, I think I've proven my point here. <laughs> it's very, very intellectual of you, Stoke Monkey. Thank you, thank you. So, why did we see you at the uh, big presidential debate over that, the weekend? That, I'm glad you asked. I'm glad you asked. Because um, that was a bit of a problem. Stoke Monkey was indeed uh, invited. I was uh, I was to be a personal guest of Miss Sarah Palin with all this uh, with all, with all this recent uh, pregnancy scare and all that business. Um, my invitation was uh, re redacted, but um, nobody told Stoke Monkey, so uh, I showed up and uh, people were there and riot See, Matt, riot gear and tasers. Wait, and wait, that's not exactly what I heard because I. I I, there is this little bit on Sorgatron08.com. Oh, really? Where, uh, well, when, of course, Sorgatron was not able to uh, come to the debates as I was invited, but I had a personal banking crisis myself. Oh, you were invited? And, uh, oh, and, last, and, 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 last but I heard I, you weren't invited. They weren't acknowledging well, you as a Well, I also wanted to point out that the Stoke Monkey will also decline to attend to something called a simian seance, whatever that means, uh, a meeting for New Jersey's proliferation, whatever, whatever that is. Interesting. Now, now, is was it you that reported this, sir? It was, it was reported right here. I, and, and was it was it, was it hand you hand or was it one of your constituents? No, it's not, everything's hand uh, I, drawn. Uh, interesting, interesting. I would like to know who to sue for these slanderous lies. Uh, Sogatron 08com of course. So you? Yes, me. In retrospect. Ugh. your ass is so getting monkey sued. Listen to me. <laughs> Monkey suit. <laughs> monkey suit. Now, whoa, 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 whoa. It's slightly as, different as opposed to... As there opposed are lawyers to and a judge, but there's more poop throwing, okay? Monkey suit. Listen to me, all right? Now, is this one of those things like an like a... Like a like a user agreement that if <laughs> something happens, like, like you would have to go to California for the trial, I have to go to, like, New Jersey jungles? Yes, something like that. Okay. Something like the... Okay. Jungles. Yes. Yes. By the way... To those of you watching at home, I am in fact bilocating. That is that is that is my dedication for the Wrestling Mayhem Show. Not only am I here in the Mayhem Show studios, I am in Doc Remedy's Antarctic location. This is correct. I can do that. I'm half monkey. Stoke Monkey, I have a hard question for you. I have a harder question for you, sir. Are you, you, you go first? <laughs> <laughs> Are you a doppelganger? Doppelganger? A doppelganger. From Doppelopolis? <laughs> 
Sorry, Dr. Cody. <laughs> <laughs> no, I am not a doppelganger. I am one of a kind! Similar to Rob Van Dam. Mung! Keys! And that Mike asks, if, if, is a monkey suit like a lawsuit, only has more Johnny Gargano in it? <laughs> very, very similar. I can't guarantee that I'm going to be represented by Johnny Appleseed, but I just may be. Nothing would be more been. American. I mean, listen, if I don't get him first. Listen, so his tights have been everywhere. Listen, I so know, on. including your bedroom, from what I hear. Oh, but that's just speculation. I'm not here oh. to spread any slander or lies. Spec spec speculation, allegation. I should have expected this coming on your show. It is getting uh, hot into the into the uh, election season, so uh, that's right. Well, that's that is partially why I came on on the Wrestling Mayhem show today. I'm taking time out of my busy campaigning schedule. I've been uh, all up and down the United States. I spent some time in Canada until someone told me that apparently they don't vote in these elections. So I, I wasted a month in Canada, but Toronto is very nice. You know, maybe you should have a discussion with the Silent Ninja. He hasn't registered yet. You have until October sixth, or I steal your soul. Listen, Sorgatron. I didn't mean it. I'm very scared of you. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Trump. It's, it's you I've come to address. Normally I come to the Wrestling Man Show to address the people. You. I've come to address you, my friend. You're a respected political opponent. And I, officially here, in front of the, the wonderful audience of the Mayhem Show, I would like to officially challenge you to a presidential debate. A presidential debate? A presidential debate. Me versus you. Let the voters decide. All right. All right. All right. Um, what about the vice presidents? Well, that is my other reason for coming on the show this week. Okay. 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 You, you it's, it's long been known since, uh, since way, way, since before I even announced my candidacy, you would be running alongside the macho man. <coughs> yes. Randy Savage. Now, my vice presidential pick, I've talked to many people. I talked to the monkey... Mojo from The Simpsons. He was on The Simpsons at one time. He just couldn't cut it. I talked to that monkey from Outbreak. He couldn't cut it either. I even talked to Mayhem Missy. She's not interested in politics. Not interested in politics. Well, she's in high school. So. Which I can respect. Yeah, I'm not even old enough to vote. She's in grade school. I can respect this. <laughs> grade school? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's like seven. Like pre-K. No. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, n my 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 vice presidential pick is someone might be a little I'm controversial. We, what's that? I'm interested in abs. Russell Fitz, it, not it politics. It abs. abs. Well, so close well, he's got him. Yeah, like Chris Lurie has said. What about the uh, the evil monkey from uh, Chris's closet? No, no, he's a communist, and this is America. <laughs> Stoke Stoke believes in pointing. Oh, Stoke, Stoke Monkey, I'll look to you in the camera. Stoke Monkey, what's that? Do you, do you, <laughs> do you promise that when you are in office, you will defeat the communists on a Sherwin Williams painting? Who told you about Sherwin Williams painting? Who told you about Sherwin Williams painting? You don't even know about Sherwin Williams painting. Have you been paying attention? Of course, I've been paying attention. I'm the Stoke Monkey. I see all. I don't know who told you. Know, that's not, that's it, not, was, I didn't think, that's not I didn't an think answer. I figured it out myself. That's the not an answer. The communist sir. logo. If you look at Sherwin Come Williams' the logo. Red. I know. Come yes. the Earth Red. I and thought this pink. was a very secretive, ongoing investigation. Apparently, Dr. Remini is in on it. It's common knowledge. They have a globe that is being covered in red paint. How much more communist could it be? Why can't it be blue or yellow? Why does it have to be red? Very, very curious. What would you do about that, Stoke Monkey? Go. Yeah. What would you? Hmm. Well, I do a little bit of investigation, and if Sean Williams is in fact a communist organization, they will be toppled like the filthy communists they are. Either that or I would put them to work uh, fixing up and repainting Iraq. Now, back That's on track. That's a horrible answer. <laughs> yeah, it's because you're running against Well, well Sorgatron's rebuttal. Sorgatron, 